No, sorry, I'm going to redo that. Bobby's are boring. Episode 21. Let's kick it. Last week on the show, Justin Timberlake and Paula's biological father appeared on the show. Also, Stevie Wonder and Paul McCartney were here jamming while two sesame seeds uh, reunited in the desert. Today, we'll see Paula return to the show. Also, robots! Here on... Ebony and ivory live together in perfect harmony. Okay, okay, enough of that. Uh, where do we go now? Uh, let's take the trout yogurt to Electra. <laughs> Way to follow the script, loser. Actually, it's in the player's guide. Uh, same thing, really. really looking forward to going back into the Monopoly building. I can't wait to get to the elevator. Uh, I'm just gonna take the stairs, so are you okay to just take the elevator? Am I okay? Uh, yeah, I think I'll be fine. This elevator takes you to the 47th floor. I assume that's where you want to go. Oh uh, yeah, that, that's great. Sorry, ma'am. Just, I've got to say that I like big hips and I cannot lie. All the foresight can't deny that when a girl walks in with the kind of big waist that takes up so much space you get stuck. You want to pull up the stuff that makes you smell all tough. I see that your jeans are tearing. I'm hooked and I can't stop staring. Is it odd that I want to get with ya and take your picture? My homeboys tried to warn me that your hips are big. This is so corny. Ooh, misses big hips. My Skyrunner cruises like a Benz. So come with me, come with me before I'm found by Tony. Let's both go dancing. I'm bad at romance and I sweat. And you bet that I've dressed up like Boba Fett. All kids are just the same, hating on to whom I spit my game. I've got the bottle rocket girl to make the fool step off. A punch they do pack. So, lady, huh? lady, what? you have what it takes to save are me. So take me, and don't make me go insane and kill you out of angst. Lady, come back. Lady. Lady. Big hip lady, come back. Oh, my elevator, you little pervert! Oh, man. So good. You are sick, a little boy! If I see you again, I will wring your neck! <sighs> yeah, whatever. No, we're not doing that. Hmm. Uh, so, where's Electra? Hmm. Looks like things have changed in here. Input the password. Salami. Nine. Eight. <sighs> Nest, seven, do you know anything? Six. Slippy ship is five, in the docking bay. Four. Correct. Please proceed. Were Earthbound and Star Fox even remotely connected? Nope. Ah, there's another one. Please input the security password. Slippy ship is in the docking bay. Nine, eight, seven. The password doesn't six, work. Crap, five, why? It's wrong. Four, three, Obviously. Two, oh. one. Oh man, I'm out of battle. I'm out of battle rockets. Uh, so we actually have to fight this guy for real? Well, we could run. Actually, we can't run from this fight. Oh, hey, I do have a bottle rocket, never mind. I should probably insert a comment here about how bottle rockets make the game a little too simple, but I won't. 
Ah, uh, whatever. Hey, this is a lecture's room. Oh, uh, hey, look at this. It's my two favorite boys in the whole city, and I do not doubt that you two have brought my beloved Trout Yogurt machine for me. Yep, we got it. Oh, oh, good. I cannot wait to read the latest Trout Yogurts. Wait, read? I, th I thought it was an ice cream machine. Oh, no. It, it dispenses comic strips, you know, and uh, I got the first 16 pages already. Okay, but I need this machine to get the rest. Oh, alright, let's see one. Okay, I dispense what I missed. Okay. Oh, it used to be bro broken or something. Maybe there are only 16 pages. That's impossible. Who would make an award-winning comic strip that's only 16 pages long? That's pretty retarded. You know, the author would have to be mentally handicapped or something. Hmm. Well, that sucks. Anyway, we're glad you got your machine, but we've got to find Paula. <sighs> well... Oh, hey. I smell technology. And baloney. It's a robot again. This one looks a little different, though. Clank, clank, dick, dick, door. Snack! Night. We can't kill this guy. Why? The sandwich. We must eat the sandwich. I would love to eat that sandwich. We should eat the sandwich. Actually, I'm gonna hit him. Um, it's not working. It's the sandwich. Is it a magic sandwich? No, it's a bologna sandwich. How do we stop this thing? We should unplug it. That'll never work. That idea is so dumb, you are so stupid, I am smart. Run on sentence. Well, I'm out of ideas then. I guess we're gonna die. Yo, man, unplug the robot! Oh, here it goes. See, Ness, I told you so. Well, see you guys! Well, that was nice of him. Anyway, let's go through this door. Please don't hurt me! I don't have Paula! Where's Paula? I... I don't know. She left earlier in the... in the fourth helicopter. Okay. But well, where's Paula? Ness, he just answered that. I will kill this bear. Meanwhile, in another location... So, Trisha, how do you like the helicopter? Oh, it's okay, but, you know, the seven I have back home are way better and go faster. Like this one time I was flying to Canada to meet the Prime Minister because we met on MySpace, and it just so happened... Trisha, Trisha, dear, huh? do you know why I brought you on the helicopter today? Because we're super cool friends. Yes. That is it exactly. So much, in fact, I want to show you the Great Pyramids. Close up. Oh my god, Paula, you're the best! Hey, did your dad ever like... <gasps> oh my god, I love this song! Sing with me, Paula! Okay. Turn around the bright eyes Every now and then I want to turn around Turn around the own nest Every, Every now and, and then, then I fall you apart dead. And I need you now tonight, Ness And I need you more if I only choke you right Wait, what? You'll be fast asleep forever And I'd love you and love you just right Cause we'd never be wrong Together we can take it till the end of the line My need to kill you, Trisha, is my only right Only right? I don't know what to do and I'm always in the darkness Your living is an insult and I'll see that it's Stops. I'm gonna kill you tonight Your death is coming, feel the fright Forever's gonna start tonight Once upon a time when Trisha
show that she loved Ness, but now she's only falling off a helicopter! There's nothing I can do, Ness! A toy! So then, I was like, be careful, Paula, and she was like, nah, I'm gonna die, and she did, so I just chilled with the mole. He was pretty cool, I I'd definitely fight him again. That's pretty ballin'. Chad Warden be ballin'. So, is that like the same time when you got that melody, or was that the other time? Yeah, it was the same time, but really, I didn't need her anyway, because I'm awesome. You know, you sound like you're a pretty bossom level-headed boy. Have you ever considered, you know, like running for city council or something? Yeah, I considered running for mayor or that one time, but then my mom was all like, you got to go to school and stuff, so I got discouraged. Oh, well, whenever you beat that game, feel free to come visit me here, Ness. I, I would love to talk to people about your travels, Ness, especially with you. Uh, sorry, I've been down the road before, and I'm just not into pedophiles. Uh, I apologize. Oh, that's cool. Uh, you know, I'm not really into little boys anymore. I mean, again. No, no, wait, I'm not anymore. What about little girls? Well, let me tell you about a dream I had. Unrelated to little girls, I mean, a little bit. You know, in the dream, I was told by a salary figure not to let the two boys and girl go to Scariba, or Scariba, or Scariba. I wasn't sure what it meant at the time, but it kept my kids from vacationing there with my wife and I for years. But anyway, now I know what it meant. It was for you, Ness. Apparently in Scariba, or Scariba, or Scariba, something big is happening, something huge. You know, the crap has hit the fan, or one could say, or hit the sand. <laughs> but seriously, I digress. Uh, maybe Paul is back by now. Uh, let's go to the helipad and check. Ness? Pokey, uh, hey, what's up? Uh, hey man, not much. I'm just chilling here waiting to steal the helicopter. How long till it's back? Uh, it can be too much longer. Uh, you guys wanna play Uno while we wait? Uh, actually, I think I can see it now. Oh, hey, it's Paula. Oh, um, hey guys. Alright, looks like I'm running a little late. <laughs> hey, can I get those keys? Oh, yeah, sure, here you go. I'm done with it. Okay, cool. Wait a minute. Pokey, aren't you mad at us for some reason? Uh, oh, yeah. You guys suck! Spankity, spankity, spankity! <laughs> Uh, well, great. Now how will we get to the beach? Hmm, I think I have an idea. Uh, so where do you think Pokey will go? That's takes too much empty. <laughs> Jeff were able to recover Paula and save the day once again. Hello! Uh, who is this? This is the mayor of Forsyth, hello! Uh, I already answered you. Uh, how are you getting through? I'm on a walkie talkie. This is channel 14. I use that one on a totally secret clubhouse fun house on awesome channel. You should get your own frequency. Ten four, get buddy every two over and out. Four out of awesome for this reason. Okay, bye. Uh, these people, anyway. Join us next time when I've gotten all of this crap figured out. Here on Armies of Orange. Hey, this is really cool because I had like friends on my walkie-talkie. That's never happened before. I just bought them one time in this Canadian tire, and people said that people were gonna be listening to me all the time, but nobody ever really talked. Yo, what's going on? Oh crap! Yo, I'll be listening. I'll find out that they're really fake lucky, so the one my father imitated me, but doing a bad job of it. Yo, I don't understand that. It's so whack. Uh oh, uh oh. Uh, uh, uh. Yo, I'm gonna beat you to death if I find out who's been doing that. Yo.
I never turned this off.